Okay. <laughs> Good morning. Eat me. Bing bong. Um. <laughs> sorry about the scuff from earlier. Um, don't mind that part. I'll probably just delete it. I didn't have my mic plugged in. That's why it was so messed up. Um. Anyway. Uh, today I wanted to draw some faces. But I wasn't sure if I, it's okay to just like open up Pinterest and start drawing from there. But so what I did, I just, <laughs> I have like an AI generated face, this kind of like website on the side. And I'll just uh probably, probably like copy and paste what I feel like drawing from there. Um, it's actually pretty amazing how far AI has gotten with uh, just generating these kinds of things. So uh, yeah. Like, uh, the one you see over here, it is, a uh, AI generated, like, this face. It's from, um, generated dot photos. I, yeah, I think that's the name of the site. Yeah, it looks like that's the name of the site, so. Oh, uh, yeah. Um. Oop. Let's go ahead and start. Um, I didn't warm up at all, so I feel like I should just, uh, get my, ma my hand moving. So I'll probably just warm up as we go. It shouldn't be that much of an issue. Um, I'm feeling, what, what color am I feeling? Start with, um, I think we'll just go down. Oh! Sorry. Let's go down the um the color wheel. Start with this color, I suppose. My drawing faces have always been like kind of like a um a comfort zone for me. Um I think the basics are pretty simple, um, but definitely hard to master, I would say. Um, I'm not a master myself, but I just really enjoy, um, I guess, like, the different, like, drawing different faces. So, so yeah. As you may notice, I'm not particularly um, that fond of like trying to like outline every um, structure of the face or like actually this is in general when I'm drawing. Um, I often uh, revert back to just uh, <laughs> putting just blobs or blocks of shape in uh, or tone just to get it started. Just how I like to work. Now drawing face accuracy is still hard for me, so um pardon me if uh <laughs> it doesn't look quite exactly the same. But, uh, yeah, I'll Try my best, as always. Whenever I do these kinds of things. And like that. it's pretty much straight. I don't see any like tips uh vertical wise, so I'm assuming that the ends of the ears would just match where they normally match is around the eyebrows for the tops and around the bottom of the nose for the bottom of the ears. 
I feel like old people, um, I guess this is pretty random, I'm just like talking, but um, like people who are, uh, who have wrinkles, not necessarily just like old people, um, have like, I, I find myself uh, having fun drawing them, mostly because like I see um, some shapes or some lines that I don't usually see on a younger face, or say for example like a, a woman's face. Um, they definitely have like a different quality to them. But it's a, uh, it's pretty fun I think to draw, or to paint. So, um, whenever you see me, like, do something like this, I don't know if you can see- Oh yeah, you can see my cursor. So when you see me do something like this, it's me, like, trying to, like, match, um, some of the- the shapes within the face. Um, so like here, I was trying to find the middle point of, um, the Widow's Peak over here, and trying to match where it is. So it's- so it's somewhere around the nostril, somewhere around here, so that's why I did that. Um, so yeah, that's the reason for doing that, in case anyone was wondering. Let's block this in. Um, by the way, I'm not trying to like, spend a lot of time with these. I'm trying to keep it simple. Um, not too complicated. Or I... Uh, I draw them out. Okay, so ears. I've always have a love-hate relationship with ears. Um, everybody has like different ears. Like, sure, you can do it like a, you can draw like a generic ear. Um, sometimes it just doesn't feel right. So I've always had like a, I wouldn't say a difficult time, but like a complicated time. Uh, when dealing with ears. Yeah. It's not quite round, just like that. I can just like carve into the shape eraser. And let me just add color to I'm matching where the points and lines meet. Let's get it darker. This one is going to get darker at the tips. Let me try to emulate that. Go more saturated instead of uh, go darker, I think.
assume that. Okay. Um, for, from this point, I can probably just do some warping or some liquefy. I could definitely just like redraw some some parts, but like uh, that takes more time. I think. Wait, where is it? Oh, liquefy. There we go. Um, I don't know if you can see me liquefying. Oh, you you don't. So you can't see my liquefy window, but I am. Uh, liquefying right now. So what liquefying does is basically uh, kind of just like a warp uh, kind of deal. So let me just bring the chin in a bit, or like the side of the cheek in. Um, just the shape of the face. Bring out, bring this jaw up. Bit. I could just redraw some of the other parts. Okay, I think that was too much. <laughs> Whatever, you know what? Let's just redraw them. Let's just redraw. It's fine. Not in a rush. Mostly I just here to like chill. That kind of stuff. We could just give him some a little bit of flair. <laughs> Start editing this. I suppose just like doodle whatever, but um I guess this is still considered doodling. Um just giving it some uh some interesting touches. It's going away a bit from uh my intended purpose of just like um drawing them in drawing the AI faces straight out, but, uh, it's fine. It's fine. We're just having fun. Big deal. It is okay. Let me just, uh, off some, uh, some more shapes. Okay. I feel like my drawing is starting to look he looks more, uh... <laughs> My drawing looks a lot different from the AI. <laughs> it's actually part of the reason why I'm not too much of... Uh, though, though, like, this is kind of like a comfort zone, I, I'm not too confident about, like, getting, um... Accuracy. Um... It's not my strength, I would say. If I really wanted to get for go for accuracy, I'd probably be measuring more. Uh, trying to eyeball it, like trying to like really eyeball the uh, proportion. But I'm really not. Like I see a shape, try to draw it, and if it doesn't look as right, it is what it is. You know, it is what it is. For this one, let me just like get a darker color. Better mark off the. Uh, um, the iris. Um, again, just measuring stuff by.
Um, I wasn't keeping time. Maybe I should like set a time limit for myself. So I'm not like just like doodling um, one face <laughs> for like a long time. Um, sorry, give me one sec. Let me just check. Oh, 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 oh. Let me check this out. Oh, it hasn't been that well. 16 minutes. Um, I think it's fine. I'll probably work on it another 4 minutes. So, uh, let's make some, uh... I should keep my brush a little bit larger. So I'm making big strokes and covering a lot more ground, rather than just, uh, doodling with a tiny brush. But yeah. I want to mark off like some of like the forehead lines, like that. Yeah, that seems fine. And then, so, just mark off these nails. Um, okay, let's, let's fix this ear a bit, um, and some more, uh, details to it, I guess, like some, uh, some more indications of, um, the parts of the ear here and there. There's this, there's always this, like, Y thing with ears, um, inside, I don't know the parts, so I'm just, like, referring to them as, like, inside and outside. <laughs> Like the white thing. <laughs> um, but it is what it is. Anatomy, anatomy terms are hard to remember. Especially if you don't like, uh, I guess like review them every now and then. Which I think I should be, but I'm not, you know. Um, let's add some saturation in some parts of the nose. Um... Definitely get ears, some saturation there. Uh, maybe even like part of the lips. Yeah. Just um. Uh, a little bit of a. Uh, design flair <laughs> the sides um you blend a bit with the paper maybe and i think i'll call that one done um could work on it more but let's move on uh, i want to have a lot of faces drawn by the end of this stream so yeah uh let's find another one Let's do, let's do a front facing face. Alright, what you got for me AI? What you got for me? Um, scrolling through. Oh, should I do a kid? I don't draw kid faces that much. So, um... Yeah, sure. Sure, sure, sure. Let's do it. And just layer in. I should just, uh... Um, what do I do? Do I just merge? Yeah, I think it's fine merging the top. I'll just, um... Or maybe not. Wait, wait, wait. Hold up, hold up. I'll just put them in a folder. Put them in a folder. Call that done. Okay. Oh, that's good. Let me zoom down a bit. There. Uh, okay. So we started off that. I guess we're going somewhere here. 
the next color. I am not too familiar with kid and uh kid proportions since I like I said I don't draw them as much. But uh yeah. Let's see where it goes. Alright, mark off. It like that. That is somewhere around here. Okay, let me just mark this off where bangs and probably the start of the hair is right there. Like somewhere, no, somewhere here. Actually, bangs is where the bangs are. So. Um, uh, let me check. Okay, I think I eyeballed the ends of the face properly. Let's mark off the ears where they are. Somewhere around there. Let's mark off. General, um, place, placement of the eye sockets. And then mark off the nose. Okay, this <laughs> this is turning a bit uh anime or yeah like chibi like. Um, but uh, it's fine. Again, I'm not too worried about like trying to get the exact proportions right. I'm just drawing and just using the AI as reference. Um, which I think is fine. I'm hiding this one. I don't have to get that back. Mm -hmm. okay. And I still look a bit off, so let me just try to mash them to each other. It'd be easier if I try to flip it. See, this is a problem with drawing uh, <laughs> uh, drawn faces is that um, symmetry becomes an issue. Oh, they look off. They look off. 
<laughs> it is what it is. Uh, it is what it is. Maybe just looks weird because he doesn't have eyebrows yet. Maybe. It's lighter on the ends. Over here. Okay, this kid doesn't look like <laughs> what I'm painting. But you know what? It's okay. Um, it's just a. Uh... Like what Bob Ross says, you know, um, happy little accidents. Not really aiming for photo accuracy. Just uh, having fun. Okay, this is why I don't draw kids. <laughs> they're hard. Like, they're hard. Like, they're a lot harder than drawing women. I would say. Maybe someone would say otherwise, but um, for me, I think kids are quite hard. Or maybe it's just because I don't have that much experience with them, uh, drawing them. That's why I'm having a hard time, maybe. This way. I mean, the kid's doing that, like, half-open, half-closed thing. It's just always awkward for me to draw. Soft um, indications of like the cheeks. I feel like the eyes might be too far apart, but I think it's fine. Gives it some uh, some kind of um, character. It looks off. You know what? It is what it is. It is what it is. Now, if you just turn off the reference, it looks fine, you know? So you don't have anything to pair with. Learn this a bit. Looks up. <laughs> uh, uh, you know what? It's fine. I, I don't want to spend too much time in it. I, I only, I think I only spent like fifteen minutes on it, or maybe even less. You know what? For that amount of time, I think it's okay. 
Sorry, kid. You don't look like you're drawing. But it is what it is. Yeah. Or maybe I can try to fix it. You know what? I'll try to fix it. I'll try to fix it. Uh, not to rush in. Let's move the eyes. See, my problem was I didn't do my, my markings. That's why. That's why. That's why it was way off. Um, this one ends here, so... Okay, it looks a bit off. I move them too much, I think. And then I'll just edit. This looks so good. Okay, like obviously if I um, was taking this more seriously, I definitely would be measuring a lot more. It's fine. It's fine. It, it does look better, I think, now that I've moved, like, the eyes. Um, some more things here. I, I'm still not doing, like, that, that, that half um, open thing. Maybe I should try to do that. With this face. Hey, I think that actually looked a bit better. I'm okay with that. Okay, moving on. Just, yeah. That's fine. Moving on. Um, let's get more AI faces. <laughs> um, where is it? Okay, there. Here we go. Let's try drawing a right-facing face. Ooh, should I draw a woman? Let's draw. Let's draw an AI-generated woman. Let's try get a young-looking one. <laughs> oh, there's an age. Okay. How about this one? There's an age, um... Filter. Female. Aha! What do you got here? What do we have here? Um... Let's draw you. Actually, you know what? Give me one sec. Be right back. B R B. Is that showing on the stream? Yeah, it is. Okay. Be right back. Real quick.
Okay. I'm back. Bing bong. Uh, I should have also just gotten water. It's okay. <laughs> I'll do that on my next uh, beer back. <laughs> uh, where were we? Right. Did I already copy? I think I did. I was drawing the wrong... Uh, okay. I was drawing on the same layer. Let me just uh, cut, uh, cut and put them in the same group. And then let's just uh, copy paste. Oh, yeah, got it. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay, that's fine. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's do purple. Or wait, maybe like a bluish, like a violet more, more violet. See, I, I was always confused with the difference between a uh, purple and violet, but I think purple is just um a mixture of blue and red, right? But closer to red, and violet. Is closer to blue. Think. I think. <laughs> I think that's how it goes. <laughs> Whatever. Um. Anyway. Do uh. This is fine. Maybe it, just a tad bit. Okay, this borderline blue, but it's okay. It's okay. Okay, just trying to mark off the face. So, um, I don't know if you noticed, but like the the way I'm going about drawing this uh these faces is I am approaching them the same way I would approach it if I were um painting with actual paints, like with acrylics or oils. Um, that's how I uh do that. So, um, generally just like marking, uh, where stuff would go or like the limits, the boundaries of, um, the face. Um, here right now, like my measurements aren't perfect, but, um, it's fine because I can always just like paint over or erase them if I need, if I need some more space. So, uh, yeah. Again, just like marking off. Uh, shadow shapes that I see are like regular um the regular positioning of the faces uh not, not the face like the regular positioning of the uh features of the face rather um that's what I'm doing right now just mark it here Oh. I, I, <laughs> I got shocked a bit by the uh, the music. Okay, again, I feel like my um, proportions are a bit off. How close the eyes are. Try to add some tone. So uh, I keep the highlights white. Okay, now this I think I have to like carve in. Let's get a darker blue, or violet, whatever. Not that much. Just like this. Again, I, I might have sound. I, I might be sounding like a broken record. I'm not really looking for um, 
photo accuracy, but as much as I can, I would want to get the features right. Um, so some of the measurements measurements are really off, um, but again, it's, I think it's fine. Happy little accidents. I love Bob Ross actually um, had a had a positive effect on me just by saying that. Like the the happy little accidents thing because you can't really control everything that goes onto your art unless you're like some kind of like insane genius but even then like the the really professional artists um even they suffer from like um not being able to do exactly what they envision in their head so like really just like the um the idea or the philosophy behind like you know the happy little accidents uh helped me a lot and like really just like you know what what goes goes it's okay if it doesn't um match my initial vision and if you think about it that kind of like goes the same with uh life right um you know you may have a plan you may have a, a lot of things in mind um maybe you thought you'd uh get a house by now maybe you thought you'd get a proper job get a a car or whatever or maybe you thought you'd you know you'd be in your dream college um whatever it is and uh sometimes things just don't go your way things just uh don't go how you envision it and it's fine you know the important thing is that you just keep on going and uh you just appreciate the happy little accidents happy little mistakes rather So thank you, Bob Ross. May you be resting in peace. Actually, is, isn't there like a Bob Ross, um, what do you call this? A Bob Ross uh, marathon right now? I think I feel like I saw that like a while back. Uh, was it a few days ago? Um, I think it's still going. I'm not going to check right now because I, <laughs> I just want to... I'm kind of like auto autopilot drawing. <laughs> I don't know if you know this because I'm just also just like talking um, about like random stuff. So like right now, I I'm pretty sure some of the proportions are like really off. <laughs> uh, that's what you get for um, not focusing that much. So definitely, would would I if I would be working like on something uh, on like a big project. Um. I would definitely give it like my 100% attention, not just like babbling <laughs> like I am right now. Um, I don't even know if the strokes I made were right. They seem okay. Could be better. I could have been more mindful of like the shapes that the eyes actually do have instead of um, kind of auto autopilot it. But yeah. So far, it's. I think it's okay. So far, so good. Okay, another thing that I find it hard on faces other than like ears um, or like eyebrows, not eyebrows, uh, eyelashes. Sometimes it's like so awkward, like how do you mark them, you know? Um, though when if I were, if, were to able like, you know, do them properly, it actually feels really nice. Because I, I love eyelashes on people, especially if they're like long. Um, they're really fun to like indicate here and there, but yeah, sometimes it gets complicated. It's like, oh, this go to the left or to the right, you know, that kind of deal. Like it's a, such a tiny feature, but like people notice it if you do it wrong, so. Okay, um, let me just, just mark off the planes of the face more um there's this 
I guess the eyebrows meet the edge of the face. Um, yeah, I think one thing that I learned about drawing women is to not, like, sure, indicate the points of the face, but not to an extent that they have, like, a really dark value in comparison to, uh, men. Um, because I think men, yeah, men have, like, more defined features and, like, a rougher feel to them compared to women, uh, women's faces. Though there are, yes, there are some exceptions to the rule, but, like, in general, a lot of women's faces are very delicate in the way um, the form of their face uh, rolls over. Um, and by rolls over, I mean like um, how it goes from one plane to another plane. So like you see here, like you can, like the, there, there's definitely a plane. I don't know if you can see my brush. There's definitely a plane. Uh, I'll just make a new layer so I can just draw. This is definitely a plane, right? And this is definitely a plane. Uh, like where the top, like a, there's a part of the eyebrows that like has like a peak so that's where it usually is and this is definitely a plane there's definitely a plane there's definitely a plane but like if you look at it um if you look at her face though this is ai generated i think it's still true it still holds true with um normal faces the transition is very very soft and sure it's like there's like a general light on there but um the transition is really really soft i think you can see it more over um on this side, wait, just delete this layer. On uh, this side of the face, where you see this, it, it's there's uh, like, if you, I mean, I, I think you can see it from afar. There's clearly like a, a difference in tone or value over here compared to this whole area, right? So, um, I guess that's what I meant. Oh my gosh, I'm drawing on the wrong layer. I think we're good, we're good. But yeah, so I, I guess that's what I'm trying to do by like marking off and then like making them softer like this. Uh, yeah. Okay, again, let me just check my proportions. Um, I think I definitely should have given more space. Actually, I can... Here's what, here's what I'll do. Here's what I'll do. I'll just bring this eye in more. Closer. I'll just cancel that and bring it. Just make sure it's like... How far is this? Okay, it's like... In this measure. Just a tiny bit closer, maybe. Because there's definitely, there should definitely be more space over to the left. Um, maybe that was too much. Eh, we'll make it work. We'll make it work. Here's what it is. We'll make it work. Um, again, finding the top is over here, finding the bottom, where the nose, oh, am I off in the nose? Yeah, I'm off in the nose. So, again, that's fine. Yeah, keep it softer. Um, and then, here's where the nose is. Get a bit softer, so it's not that uh, noticeable. Like the the line over here. I don't know. I don't know nose anatomy too. I actually don't know a lot. 
already forgot the names of um, a lot of the anatomy terms. Um, sorry uh, to all my teachers who taught me anatomy. <laughs> uh, I just don't remember them for the life of me. I only I only know the uh, sternocleidomastoid. <laughs> It's, I think it's the it's is this thing right? There's this is sternocleidomastoid, like this thing that goes from like the um like from the top of your neck down to like the um the base or like to your this is called a clavicle. I think it's a clav. Yeah, yeah. I know my anatomy a bit. <laughs> Press X to doubt. But uh, yeah. I know it. I, I know anatomy. <laughs> I just wanted to mark off the neck, so it's not just like a floating head. Well, it technically still is a floating head, but it l it's less like a floating head. Now it's more like a floating neck and head. <laughs> you know? Let me find... Bop! Bada... Bada bop! Okay, I think some of my angles are really harsh, so it's starting to look like a guy. I'm trying to find ways to soften features. It's also the hair, I think. Uh, it's, it, I think it's the subtle things that um makes this. This one looked really like a girl, and mine is looking like a guy. So I'm trying to figure out how to go about it. I think it's this part over here, maybe, that could help. Um, sorry, give me one sec. I'm checking something. Okay, we're good. We're good. I should bring this whole part closer. I think that is what feels off right now. Um, what I'll do, I can just, um, yeah, I think it's the length. It's the length of throwing me off, yeah. Let me just um, do some Photoshop magic. Ah, there it is. There it is. There it is.
Turn back off the Y. Okay, I think this is where the AR is a bit wrong. I'm pretty sure there's always a Y there. Um, it just uh, indicate some value on the ears. Some parts. Erase my bounding lines. I need them anymore. Okay, I feel a lot better about this one. Okay, maybe bring up the chin. <laughs> the chin a bit. Feels a little bit long. Maybe if I do this. Or I think I just do this instead. Feel better about that one. I'm gonna mark off the uh, the lines of the lips, and then I'll head in and uh, hit this bottom part of the lip. Now uh, fill it in, and hit the top part. Get the dip. Darken the edges and the line itself. I think that's fine. This is what I meant by like um, the features of the woman's face should be a lot softer because when you start indicating like this, she starts to look a lot older. So let's uh, try to soften them up a bit. Maybe you still indicate them, but not too harsh. Something like that. Wisps under here. Put a little bit of flare. <laughs> like, um, how I did with the first one. Um, I'll also do the same with this one too. <laughs> um, let's see.
Okay. Next space. What we got? What we got? What we, what we, what we got? Um... Why? Oh, what's this? What's this filter? What does that do? Ah, interesting. Interesting. load more what you got for me um let's remove this filter see where it happens What is this? <laughs> AI, what are you doing? Like, look at this. <laughs> that's pretty funny. Uh, that's pretty funny. Dang, AI is so amazing. AI is just like the amount of things that they just are able to like copy. Like I, I like I don't know. Like I'm pretty sure there's, there's some like program that like some people made, but like, how is it this good? This blows my mind. Um, sorry, give me one more sec. I'm just like looking for faces that I feel like drawing. This one looks pretty natural. Okay. Do I want to draw teeth though? Uh, sure. <laughs> Let's uh, have it as a challenge. Let's draw teeth. Yeah, I can flip this one. It's fine. Oh. Let's put this. Uh, put this in this layer. Let me give it some space. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh.
Uh, sorry. Okay, I was looking for more faces, but that's fine. That's fine. <clears throat> Moving on to neck color. Next color. Ooh, I'm from. Okay, I guess we can do blue now. I want to compare the this blue to this blue. It's almost the same. So let's go a, light, a little bit lighter. Or, um, a little bit down the scale. Okay, that's fine. That's okay, that's okay. And just bounding, basic bounding runs. Maybe just keep it there. That's the top of the hair, right? Yeah, that's the top of the hair. This is like the the start of um the hair from the forehead, the vision. Hairline, that's what I was trying to say. <laughs> that's the word I was trying to find. Yeah. This is the cheek, so it's If that's a cheek, that means the eyes are over here. Tip of the nose. No. It goes down over here. Don't know how many lighting this. I think let me just tone everything. Give some time. Oh, well, another thing, I could be more structured with the way I do things by like just using multiple layers. But uh, I think just having one layer painting over it is fine. It also replicates a bit of like um, uh, traditional painting, so it's not that much of a big deal. Oh, one sec, I just remembered something. I'm just gonna...
Okay, back to here. Um... Critique, um, I think it's actually better to not indicate like the lines Um, cause it just looks off but I know a lot of like artists just like I just like keep it as like a flat Um Tone Where like this transitions from like the I guess the back to the, the front But yeah, I think that's what I'll try to do with this one Just keep it like that Should be fine Yeah, I feel like the the face is a bit off, like um maybe proportion wise. Like some of the features uh, are off. <laughs> I think it's fine. It's okay, as long as it doesn't look bad, I think.
Yeah, I can just give her like a different kind of clothing, I guess. Maybe like a something like that. Yeah, I like it. Okay, I can soften the marks I've made. Get some uh, some of that highlight in there. Some of that darkness in the hair. Okay, what's next? Let's do a let's do a an old person. So an old person. <laughs> Be a, an old lady. Why do why is there only middle aged? Oh gosh, they all have like the same hairstyle. What is happening here, AI? What is happening here?
Um, maybe I'll find more if I. Look to a different uh, AI uh, face generator. Ah, uh, this person does not exist. I remember this um this uh, site. So just keep on refreshing and see if I can find something. Okay, I don't know if I want that site. How about this one? Bored humans. Wait, it's just giving me one face. Uh, isn't there like a... Ah, uh, here's one. Okay. Okay, how do I get here? Oh wait, is this the same site I'm using? It is. <laughs> uh, what's this? Face generator? Interesting. Here, let me try it out. Um... Neutral, maybe that. Um, okay, female, generate new face. Oh gosh, what are these faces? <laughs> oh my gosh. It has to be the skin tone. Ah. Okay, don't give me a kid. Don't give me a kid. <laughs> okay, no glasses. Let's not have glasses. Hair length, long. <laughs> yeah, these faces are wild. Oh my, what are these amalgamations? What is happening? Okay, the AI is having a hard time with this one. <laughs> uh, okay, let's just keep trying. Oh gosh, what was that? Okay, I should. If only there was a re if only there was a way. I guess like, there is a way to, for me to stream this. Um, honestly, I <laughs> okay. I should have been streaming it, but um, I'll pass for now. I 
I just need, I just want like, um... A good photo to draw from. Um, here I'll just go to random. Okay. Uh, res I'll reset my uh, filters. And uh, yeah, go back here. See what uh we have. Oh, I should draw a guy with a beard. <laughs> should draw a guy with a beard. And I want to draw from an angle, so maybe like right facing. Where is it? Where's the filter? Uh, head pose, right facing, apply. Uh, okay, I should also just set it to male. Alright, give me one sec. I'm I'm really just looking for a photo I would like to draw. Why is it so hard to find a guy with like a beard? That seems fun to draw. You know what? Yeah, sure, whatever. Let's just take you. I'll I'll just take you. You work. So we were here. Get this um yeah, that 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 works. Oh it's already eleven thirty eight. What time did it start? It's my stream manager. Uh stream manager. Okay. It's been an hour thirty. Okay. Maybe I'll go for another 30 minutes. So like maybe this one and one more uh end pinning and I'm going to uh rest and because I want to stream later and continue persona. I think that's my plan for today. And see how far we can uh get in persona again. Like last night, I was um, I was really tired, but I still wanted to like stream and like play Persona. Um, that's what I did. Like I literally just knocked out <laughs> the moment I ended the stream. It was uh, it was a really tiring day. I uh, had a lot of uh, stuff to do.
Uh, I have to make up his hair. Um, let's see. What hair should I give you? Right, this kind of works. <laughs> it's like a classic, like a messy um, hair. Clearly didn't use a brush. Really, um, really straight. Okay, I wasn't checking. <laughs> I was actually on autopilot. Um, I wasn't checking proportions. My bad.
in there for this. Do 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 do. Let me take the uh, burn thing, this bird.
just tone in some parts and I guess it's not just completely like white. Okay. I think that's fine. Could be I could work on it more. Just tap it. Okay. Okay, what's the time? Slow in fifty already? Hmm. Uh I guess I'll just end here. I, I was hoping to do more. Um within the time that I set for myself, but you know what? It's fine. It's fine. Let me just uh turn these off. Oh, wait. Where have I cut? Uh, turn you off. Okay. So these are the faces I've drawn today. Let me just uh arrange them. Mm -hmm. Them bigger. I think out of the ones I've drawn is my favorite. The the blue one. Thought it was pretty nice. Where I put you? This here. <laughs> I'm trying to arrange them. That's fine. Uh, over there is fine. And then... Where's the kid? Kid? And... This guy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Grab everything here. Um, oh, like that? Yeah. Um. So that was fun. Uh, I will be having uh, another art stream, maybe sometime in the future. Um. Yeah, I think at the end of this day, after my Persona stream, I will have a schedule now. Um, and uh, yeah, thanks for watching the stream. Thanks for being here. Uh, yeah, I'll come back around 2 p.m. maybe. Yeah, around 2, I'll be streaming uh, Persona 5 Royale again. So I'll see you guys then. Alright. Uh, anything else? Miss anything? You know, I think I'm good. Alright, see you guys. Bye-bye. Bing bong.